The Force is with you, young Skywalker. But you are not a Jedi yet. Hey, what is up, YouTube fam? This is Dupree, aka Darth Hater, here with some fresh, brand new Star Wars news for you. But before we get into it, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And also check out my last video because it greatly helps out the channel. So let's get into it. So this one comes to us from GameSpot. Over the weekend, story details of Star Wars Eclipse leak. Other sources now claim that the leak was intentional. Documents concern Eclipse's story details were leaked to the Sacred Symbols podcast. According to Inside Gaming, it was a controlled leak meant to gauge interest in the title. Sources claim that the leak was also meant to bolster recruitment efforts for Quinetic Dream. The leak revealed that Eclipse centers around an alien race called the Zaran, an empire on the outskirts of the Star Wars universe. The story concerns a married couple, Sarah and Zendo, who find themselves on opposite sides of a political conflict However, the game is still in pre-production and will likely not release until 2026 or later. Eclipse's announcement trailer was released at the 2021. Even at the time, it was clear that the game was far off and likely a way for the studio to raise recruitment. Quantic Dream has also been at the center of accusations of toxic, sexist, and racist workplace culture, as well as financial mismanagement. The company denied allegations what do I think about this? Honestly, with this game and that kind of convoluted... I'm hearing that this game takes place 200 years before the events of Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace. So this is in the whole High Republic era, which is the Golden Age of the Jedi, which I haven't really read or dabbled too much into. I have a lot of the books and comic books. I just have not had any interest in reading them, especially from watching some of the you know videos about it on starwars.com and their youtube channel and also other people who've actually read the books maybe this might help to spark some interest i mean the trailer itself when it came out was amazing it was firing on all cylinders all star wars cylinders i should say introducing new characters and very intriguing cinematics and then also having yoda himself in there but when I say Eclipse centers around an alien race called the Zaran, it's maybe kind of like borrowed from legends. Like maybe like the Yu Yuzon Vong or Ancient Sith or something. Um, they kind of showed this new alien species in the trailer, which the gray looking aliens that come out of the ooze and were drumming something. It's maybe something like that. And then they also talk about the story revolving around the married couple, Sarah and Zendo. So I'm thinking it's gonna be maybe like a choose your own destiny or it's a game where it's like you can play as Sarah and switch off and be Zendo. Very interested about this game and I have a lot of high hopes. I just hope it's really good. It just really sucks that this game is gonna be coming out so far along the pipeline that I'm just a little concerned that this game is gonna come out so far down the pipeline and that you know all the trailers and everything the the big hype that they just you know announced for it like last year will be for nothing but I understand that with what's happening with the company they need to get a lot of new fresh people to come in to work for them, especially since this game is very, very early in the pre-production stages. It's nowhere near from complete. But anyway, uh, let me know what you guys thought about this little excerpt. Um, are you still hyped and excited about Star Wars Eclipse? Does the trailer still get you? Or after the announcement that this game is coming out in 2026 or later, and now this announcement, what are your feelings? Let me know you guys' thoughts down below in the comment section. And if you guys like this video, please hit that like button. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that bell to get notifications for all my latest videos. That would be great. Anyway, guys, take care. See you in the next one. May the force be with you. Bye.